Okay, so here I'm going to show you how to upload uh, an image and add it to the gallery. Go to Component, Focal Gallery, and you can go directly to Images if you want to. Uh, typically, I'll just click on the gallery, and then you can click on Images up here or Images down there. It's the same thing. So click on Images, and then we'll click New up here. You can use the multiple add. I had some issues using that. This seemed to work better if I just did the one at a time. Um, first thing to do is go to File Name, and we want to select a file, and scroll down to the bottom. Depending how big your, uh, you might have your window farther open, you might be able to see this right away. But you can go here to choose File, and then I have a just a test image here on the desktop that I'll click on and open and start upload. The maximum size is 800 by 600 pixels and you know what I might have too large of an image. Let's see. Okay, this seem to work. So now I just want to go and select that image and I could have put it in a folder. Uh, these folders is what I created just to help organize things a little bit better. Um, these are actually, a lot of these are actually accidental duplicates but I'll just leave this one out here in the outside of any of the folders for right now. So I'll click on it. It'll get selected in here. I'll give it a name. I'll just call it test image. Alias uh, doesn't matter. That'll be filled in here in category. This is important. And these have been set up from before, these categories. So we'll just go and put it in on uh, colored pencil sketches for right now. Scroll on down. Um, everything else is fine. You can put in, uh, yeah, just, yeah, everything else is fine. It's set to be published. If it wouldn't be published, you wouldn't be able to see it on the front of the website. So I'll just say uh, save and close for right now. And I'm going to go over here to view site and let's just uh, take a look here. We were under color pencil sketches. And there we see it here at the bottom. So if you'd want to get it to the top to be the first one, uh, I'm just back here under images again. Let's go to that image. Where is it at? Oh, sometimes I'll go on display 20. I'll just say it's a display all. And it'll reload. And another thing you can do here is uh, just to, to filter these out, these are different filter settings, I'll just filter um, the color pencil sketches. Right, there we go. Test image. So if I want to change it to the front, there's a couple of different ways to do it. Um, if I want to get it to the top, this is the, the best way to do it. Just click on the image, open it up, and ordering right here. Click on that drop down menu and go up here to order first. Click save and close. And the reason it isn't up at the top right now is because we're sorting by title. If we go over here and sort by ordering we would see the test image is at the top. And if we go to the website and refresh, it'll be the first image here. So now if I want to go and delete this image, go back into the back end of the website, and I can either unpublish it just by checking here. This will unpublish it. It will still be loaded on the site, the back end of it, but it won't be visible to the public. So you could just click on that, but I just want to delete it. So I'll just click the checkbox here. And go up here to delete. Click OK. And after it's gone, go back to the front end, refresh the page, and it's no longer there. Now, if you want to edit uh, some of the articles and what the articles are, like the about page here. You go back into the back end of the website 
and that's under content in the article manager so if you click on the article manager you can see the different articles that are on the site so the about Brandon one if you click on that which okay right now the permissions aren't set to let you do that um, I can change that if you want to change the articles but yeah you would click on it and it's just a WYSIWYG editor where you can go in and enter in text so we can get that at a later time so yeah, that's it. If you have any questions, let me know.